It's not RC. Adventures in Radio Control. Radio Control. <laughs> this would be Matt Hall from SimpleCopter.com. I'm going to shut up for a second and just uh, let you watch him fly. <laughs> Yeah, I think you get the idea. Uh, what Matt can do with a multi-rotor is just sort of mind-bending. Amazing stuff. So, uh, pretty much immediately after seeing Matt's uh, videos on YouTube, I decided, you know what, I've got to give this a try. This looks like way too much fun. So, me being me, I decided I was going to design and build my own. Although, I ended up actually just uh, pretty much basing it on Matt's awesome design. My uh, central hub is my own design, but everything else, all the hardware and electronics, are all exactly the same as Matt's simple copter. But you know what? All this hard work was completely unnecessary, because uh, Matt's done all that hard work for you. You just head over to his website, simplecopter.com. There you can buy like the frame and all sorts of other parts and bits for this stuff. And you can build one of these yourself, and um, he's even got... Uh, videos on YouTube shows you exactly how to put these together. And then this apply pressure. This tape works really good. Anyway, my other reason for making this video was to uh, show you my experience uh, with a tricopter and how I did. Alright, I built myself a tricopter. Uh, I've never flown this stuff before, never flown multi-rotors, but uh, I'm gonna give this a whirl. It's just safe. That's important. Flying into the window is told. All right. This thing comes at you, run. <laughs> so actually, you want to just stand slightly behind me, maybe? That's a good idea. <clears throat> oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> and on. All right. It's armed. Oh, look at that. Yeah, my server in the back there, doing its thing. <clears throat> Oh yeah. It's interesting the back road is lifting off first, that can't be good. Oh there we go. It's flying, look at that. Never flown one of these before, amazing huh? While that's not entirely true, I had actually practiced quite a bit on my simulator before taking the maiden flight with the real thing. And I've flown it on the simulator quite a bit. Okay, <laughs> that was coming our way. Hey, look at that! Why? It does. <laughs> Any crash you can walk away from is a good one. Yeah, that wasn't a crash, that was a controlled, um, <laughs> something. <laughs> All right. A heavy landing. Heavy landing, right. All right, let's try that again. How are you supposed to blip it into the air? Are you supposed to like not pansy around and just like get it up there really fast? I don't know if I like that idea, but let's try it. Ah. So maybe this isn't as hard as I figured it might be. Actually, it is pretty hard, but um, you get used to it pretty fast. So anyway, I flew around a little bit more uh, that day and did pretty good. A little bit. Sweet. It's like an alien. <laughs> <laughs> really? I'm going to attempt to flip. Okay. I'm going to attempt to flip. I, I dialed up the rates on this thing. Something crazy. I stick mine out there to you. <clears throat> I'm going to wreck my tri tricopter now, aren't I? Well you, wreck well, you wrecked yours last time, though. It's my turn to wreck it. Well, I put it on the same rates as this guy who flies the 3D stuff online. And it's utterly unflyable. It is just, you move it more than like a, eh, it's like, whoa. I should probably explain this a little better. On the KK2 board, there's what's called stick scaling. Um, I banged in the same numbers that uh, Matt had used. 
uh, and they're really, really twitchy. But what I then did, I went back on my radio and I set up uh, low rates, medium rates, and high rates. So I had some control over uh, just how twitchy she was. But I think I get up like 20 feet, and try a flip, dump it down into low rates. Low rate's pretty handleable. You can handle it pretty good, but uh, I'm just gonna fly it around a little bit so I'm used to it. Okay. Oh, got an orbit. Meep. I got rudder control. Very good. Oh, yeah, she's twitchy now. <laughs> Couldn't even do that before. What are you doing? Just get down here. Okay. Like, you know, super twitchy. So the idea is you're supposed to punch it, get it going up, and then do the flip while it's going up, I guess. Yeah. At least the guy was saying. This is medium rates. I don't know. It's got a lot of authority, that's for sure. Alright, we're going to try it. Ready? Oh hell yeah! There you go! <laughs> Did it! Alright, I can land now, I'm not gonna do that again. <laughs> Let's bring it down. Your turn. Sweet! Kanye is just getting started in multi rotors too. He's got a pretty sweet little quadcopter and he's got four motors instead of my three. Uh, we haven't talked him into trying uh, any flips yet though. We'll have to see about that. So anyway, uh, one flip, ah uh, yeah that's not enough, we gotta try this again. Um, yeah this didn't go quite so well. Apparently I'd accidentally <clears throat> flipped it into high rates, which I didn't realize. Uh, yeah that's not gonna end well. Oh shit, I've broken a prop. I kind of dinged one of my propellers, probably shouldn't have flown, but you know what, it really didn't make any difference considering what happened next. Oh my god. Super crazy twitchy, oh yeah. Good. Oops. <laughs> you missed it. Huh? You missed it. <laughs> and what did you do? What you do? I got a little excited. <laughs> you get carried away? I was trying to do flips. It what? did a, it did a lot of flips. Yeah. Right to the ground. On purpose or not on purpose? Yeah, on purpose. On purpose. Well, yeah. first one was on purpose. The second one I got a little carried away. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, you did a, oh, I, I was doing the flips, man. Yeah, I was doing them pretty good, too. Did you record that at least? I did. Nice. Yeah. Right. But the beauty of this thing is I'll probably have this flying this afternoon. Oh, you broke like three dollars with the wood dowels. I know, like, that's all oh. I broke, man. It's the only thing that's gone. Props are a bit of a pain, but... Uh, What's the link on the servo? Does, what gives there? You, you can see, it just, any... just popped off. Oh, well, the, the whole, nice. well, the servo is just tied yeah, up on there too. Yeah, keeps you from stripping servo gears, everything. Yeah, well, it's a, it's a metal, it's a nice high-tech metal gear. It's a, it's good and strong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, I flipped the hell out of this thing. Like, it was like, whoo. Uh, I, it, it flipped and it just oh, went, no. it went around like three times. Like, whoo, 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 whoo. I was like, oh boy, I went to hit the order level. Yeah. And I botched the switch. I didn't hit the right switch. That's the switch there. I missed it. <laughs> yeah, I had plenty yeah. of time. I was like, Your okay. controller says like, Berserk mode. <laughs> like, it's doing it in the air. I was like, okay, flip the switch, everything will be fine. Yeah, yeah. I, I hit the damn wrong switch. Yeah. Stupid. Oh, it's in high rates. No wonder. Duh. I'm supposed to do that in medium rates. No wonder. Darn it. And we're back for even more punishment. Ah, this time we're going to try this on low rates and see how it does. Nice big mellow flips, we like that. Yeah. 
Yeah, baby. By this point, I'd progressed on to using medium rates, and uh, things were looking up. You know what? This is starting to look vaguely reminiscent of uh, one of Matt's videos. I mean, I'm still nowhere near his level, but um, we're getting there. I think I might be getting the hang of this. This is like awesome fun. Yeah, I'm still a little shaky on my recoveries. I can do the flips all right, but you know, coming back to level afterwards, I gotta work on that a little bit. I'm also losing a lot of altitude, which I'm gonna, you know, I need to get it sort of like, end up at the same altitude I started the trick at. But we're getting there. Ha, um, oh, man, this is fun. So I'm gonna do lots more of this and get even better, hopefully. Anyway, hope you enjoyed that. Uh, please subscribe and uh, all that good stuff. Uh, see you next time, bye-bye. Drop something. I did it. Something fell off me. Ah, <laughs> oh, that wasn't good.